James Hinchcliffe and Sharna Burgess are back together on the ballroom floor as Lori Hernandez mourns the death of her grandmother and another couple says goodbye to the ballroom. On Monday night's semifinals episode of Dancing with the Stars, it was revealed Lori's grandmother had died after a heartwarming pre-taped package had been set to air this week. Hi, Lauren. This is Grandma. I'm very, very proud of you, Mamita. Continue doing the way you want it. Fantastic. Okay, Mama? The 16-year-old Olympian pushed on in honor of her late grandmother and performed a beautiful foxtrot with her pro partner, Val Schmerkowski. Lori was visibly crying during the emotional performance. Ooh, and the two received a well-deserved perfect score. I feel ready to come back and, and give it my everything, and so I'm not trying to hold back. Just like Lori and Val, Sharna and James definitely didn't hold back, performing an epic Argentine tango. After the 29-year-old race car driver's pro partner injured herself and was unable to dance with him for over two weeks. With James' story, he came back from an injury, and hopefully this week is the same for us, that I come back from an injury, and we end up better than ever. That they did. The two almost got a perfect score, and Sharna was blindfolded during the entire dance. James even busted out a handstand on a chair to finish their amazing performance. Hands down, you are the best male dancer we've ever had on this show. Both Lori and James will go on to compete in next week's finals in hopes of winning the Mirabal Trophy. But Tara Jolet and partner Sasha Farber, who received two perfect scores of the night, will not. The couple leaving right now, Tara and Sasha.